Hello, my name is Robert Grizzle, and this is my discussion post for American Revolution through Liberty University Online. The topic I want to discuss tonight is the story of Molly Pitcher. Uh, Molly Pitcher was, first thing I want to look at is who was she, okay? Molly Pitcher was um, and is today one of the most famous heroines from the American Revolution. According to the story, um, she was at the Battle of Monmouth in 1778, at which time um, there's very little known about Molly. In reality, Molly uh, was considered by some to be a camp follower, uh, which uh, these women usually didn't have the best reputations. Um, so, but the story goes that her husband was manning one of the cannons with a, a cannon crew. He was wounded, and Molly, who was bringing um, water to the cannon crews uh, to be thrown on the barrels and in the barrels of the cannons, um, took up his spot on the cannon crew and fought alongside with the rest of the men. Okay, this is the the legend. In reality, though, there is actually very little known about her from that time period. Uh, the first account we actually have of her um, comes from 50 years later. Um, a, a gentleman by the name of Joseph Plum Martin. Um, Joseph Plum Martin is one of the most uh, prolifically quoted diarists from the American Revolution. Um, but he wrote his diaries, or he, his memoirs, 50 years later, and that's whenever he wrote this story. According to him, though, uh, and this comes from an article, or excuse me, this comes from a chapter in a book uh, known as, uh, it's referred to as, um, it was written by David Martin, and its title is Good Golly, Miss Molly. Um, according to Joseph Plum Martin, uh, she was a camp follower uh, who, when she saw what was going on, she, he describes seeing a woman, doesn't give a name, doesn't refer to her as Molly Pritchard, uh, Pitcher, but he describes a woman taking up a position with the cannons and even describes a cannonball going between her legs at one point. Um, now... Another question we want to look at would would a woman of the some other profession have filled the shoes of this female revolutionary representative, and does this person actually uh, still hold importance in, in this form of an icon? In reality, there were many stories that came out from different battles of women, and the stories were all very similar. Uh, the thing that really adds to the story of Molly, um, by not only was she in Joseph Plum Martin's diary or memoir, she was also mentioned uh, in several different other stories starting in the, eight, the 1820s and 30s. And these varied, but by the 1840s and 50s, these had all started to come together. Um, would someone else have been um, able to fill these shoes? Obviously, yes, because there were several stories told. Um, now, does this actual person still hold importance in famous in this famous icon? Um, the story gets very interesting. Um, as I said, there's many stories. Her story starts to change. She's originally not spoken of very favorably, but it, as far as her position, but eventually she becomes known as the wife of the man who was shot and uh, who stands up for her man as a patriot and fills in. Um, but this story changes over time. In an article uh, by J. Zemer, uh, entitled Irish Molly P uh, Pitcher, he talks about the fact that um, her name was actually Molly McCauley, 
and she was now renowned in history as Molly Pritchard. The thing was, she was claimed by the Irish. In reality, she was Dutch. Her um, grandson, or excuse me, her granddaughter in 1883 made the comment. Um, it was not until 1876 the claim was made for her of having to take having taken her husband's place at Monmouth. She was there for she was there, however. Um, she also states that um, she was Dutch or Deutsch as uh, sauerkraut. Okay. Um, but does she still hold up? And what is her position in society today? It still has a very um, high position. Um, she's one of the better known heroines. Uh, as a matter of fact, in New Jersey, there's Molly Pritchard, Pitcher Inn and Molly Pitcher Exxon Station in Monmouth County. And there's also a Molly uh, Pitcher rest stop on the New Jersey Turnpike. So she still holds up even today. Um, now, is this the same person? That's up for debate. Um, but why haven't writings chal challenging the validity of the uh, legend affected public praise? Um, we all, uh, America has always needed its heroes. And so once these things become ingrained in our social um, consciousness, they're very hard to overthrow and hard to change people's minds about. But um, I hope this was useful, and I uh, hope everyone has a good night. Thank you.